A title card says, Kristen Story. My name is Kristen, and I have three nieces who I am caring for, ages 9, 7, and 3 years old. My nieces have always been a big part of my life. I have watched them grow up and always felt, as their aunt, I should be someone they could count on. When the caseworker came to my door asking if I could take them in while my sister worked on her recovery, I knew I needed to step up and help them. Since October 2020, they have lived with my fiancé and myself. The older two girls have enjoyed participating in many different sports such as basketball and soccer. The baby has even enjoyed participating in a little learner's dance class at the YMCA. The process of getting the girls was in an emergency situation. They needed immediate placement. The girls were fortunate not to have to spend a day away from family. I feel being an advocate for the girls and being a voice for the voiceless is the most important part of being a kinship caregiver. Due to the trauma the girls have experienced, they needed supportive services. I needed to learn how to navigate the systems to get them what they needed. With the right amount of perseverance and positivity, the girls can really feel supported and help to heal from the situation that brought them into kinship care. I believe the agency having an awareness of the needs of each individual family is what helps kinship caregivers and their children find the stability in their situations. This video was developed by the Capacity Building Center for States under contract number HHSP 233-2015-000-71-I. Funded by the Children's Bureau, Administration for Children and Families, U.S. Department of Health and Human Services. The opinions expressed do not necessarily reflect the views and policies of the Children's Bureau. Logos for the Children's Bureau and the Capacity Building Center for States.